Hi everyone. Hi everybody. In today's video, we are going to be reviewing this um, polish, this combo with base coat and top coat. And this color is called Zero to Hero. Oh boy. And this one is, this is the Extreme Last Base Coat. Extreme. Extreme. Bonding, innovative bonding technology creates a strong basis for extreme long-lasting manicure. 80% confirmed longer wear. Oh, okay, so 80% confirmed longer wear. So it's not 80% longer. But 80% of, of people, people confirm yes. longer wear. So it could be like one day longer. Who knows, right? It could be 15 minutes longer. Made in France. Hmm. Fancy. Oh, fancy. Okay, oh, so boy. and this one is extreme gel top coat, mm -hmm. which of course is not a gel, it's a nail polish. And this one is made in UK, and this one is made, not that I really, France as well. So, so France, Essence France is UK. like, yeah, Essence is like a cheap drugstore brand that's available everywhere. Here I find the collect the, um, there were, we don't have too many choices. The collections are quite small. So anyway, limited. 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 Kind of a little boring. Okay, so we did the manicure already, and we're going to just go on with the video. Mm -hmm. I don't know much about this brand. We used the, the beautiful blue a couple of videos ago, and that kind of made me curious mm. about this brand. So the base coat, the brush is decent. I mean, for base coat, it doesn't really matter how mm. the brush is. The color has a wide brush. Mm. So that's good. Let's sniff the base coat. I always do. Yeah. Oh, and I, I would like to just correct something, if I may. Okay. It's not that it is a cheap oh. drugstore brand. It is a budget-friendly brand. Yes, it's yeah, budget-friendly. Yes, budget-friendly. You know, for You're right. young adults that may be <laughs> not so young. I mean, finance not, limited. Yeah, not only young. Mm. People of all ages could be yes, financially. Yes, I don't want to single anybody out. Yeah, financially, uh, what would you call it? Limited. <laughs> limited. So budget friendly. Mm hmm. Yes, sounds way better. It does. But actually, I know some people that uh, say that it's it's it lasts long and it's a good polish. And Although I have to say, I've heard from a chemist, and I think you all know who I'm talking about. I don't. Yeah, um, you know that price sometimes is. Uh, you get what you pay for. Yeah. But Isn't that with many knows? things in life? You mm -hmm. get what you pay for. Yeah. Don't cheap out on, on things like tattoos, let's just say, or permanent makeup. <laughs> okay, that's like a little off topic. Permanent makeup, yeah, for sure. Well, tattoos not necessarily, well. because it's you get what you pay for. Not always. I mean, some people are, but like really good people are not going to be cheap. No. That's for sure. Not usually. There's a fluffy. Okay, so the base coat went on, you know, good. And it dried very well. Can you not cross your arms, please? Okay, dry kind of matte. Ooh, dry. that is really nice. Yeah, it's dry and it's like, feels like it's- uh, Smooth? It's like it's very different. It's very different. <laughs> <laughs> it feels very uh, like matte. I don't know, mm. it feels matte. Like. So this one has uh, a zero to hero. Nice brush. It looks kind of watery. Yeah, we'll see. I'm, I'm gonna concerned. shake it a little bit. Let's give it the shakey shake. So it's a small bottle, uh, eight milliliters, just like, well, Dior, I think, has 10. But Dior is like $30 versus three. 45. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll see how this... Brush is kind of fat and stubby. No, this is not bad, look. And... Application seems to be good so far. It was good enough and shocked you enough that you yeah, just I stopped, stopped dead in your tracks. So that's kind of an impressive thing. I'm going to try to go a little bit thinner to make sure that this dries well. Because we're going for pizza next. <laughs> right? Yeah, company dinner. Mm hmm. Oh, 
looking for pizza. Oh boy. I like the color, I like the application so far. Um, yeah, so we're gonna review it. He's going to wear it for a week. Oh my God, what is this? It's a floppy. But how are we gonna do the next video? Cause it's Easter. We don't. Happy Easter guys, no videos. <laughs> Um, let's do some. We'll figure something out. We it, we might do like a ten day test or something. We'll figure it out. But anyway, so yeah, we're gonna do the test. See how it wore. See, oh my god. See how it wore. Or see how it wears. Yeah, wears. Hop, da, ba, da. Mm -hmm. Well, first coat, first impression. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Bad. It kind of smells good, you know, for nail polish. <laughs> I actually like how nail polishes smell. That explains a lot. Yeah. Sadly, doesn't it smell good? It's it's nail polishy. I mean, granted, but it's, it's kind of got sweet. like sweeter tones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm not gonna drink it. No, no. Well, not today. That was oh God. But yeah, it has like a. Mm hmm Yeah, kind of like a sweet aftertone, I guess. Like soon we're gonna be like those perfume guys. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh, it smells so good. It, was, it but... smells like leather and tobacco. And no, so... no, it would be like the chemicals. We would be like listing the chemicals. Oh, goodness. It smells like, you know, I don't know what the chemicals are. But... Red 47. <laughs> 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 it smells like sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful acetate and a, a slight hint of uh, blah blah. And radiation. Blah, blah. Yeah. Wouldn't that be funny if this wore like perfectly? Well. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? Without watching the rest of the video. Mm. Please share bets. Mm -hmm. And for those of you who have actually used it, uh, let us know yeah, what you think of it. You know, experience with the this. comment section down in the doobly doo. You know, I have to say, the small bottles of nail polish are not a stupid idea because usually you don't use you the polish. Less. Yeah, you waste less. But it's you actually don't pay because actually, I actually can I stop saying that word? Actually. Seriously. I, yeah, I know this one nail polish company. And she was saying you're often you're not paying as much for the nail polish. You're paying for the labels, for the bottling, for the blah blah everything. So Which makes sense. Yeah. I mean obviously for the ingredients too, but the bottles and the labels are also very expensive. Oh yes. Okay, we should have let it dry a little bit longer. Should have, could have, what if didn't. didn't. It is what it's it is. It's not bad. I'm going to give uh, this other hand maybe a couple more minutes to dry. Mm -hmm. Or not. On a completely random note that none of you can actually see right now, but the sky is like sunny and yet black. Mm hmm. Well, wow. some extreme overcast. You know what? The application is fantastic. How's the brush? It's actually good. Mm -hmm. My initial impressions of the brush when I seen it, it just seemed thick and stubbly. Yeah, yeah, but it's not bad and it's soft. Yeah. So. Hmm. It's a nice color too. I, you know, it is. It's like a bluish gray, you know? It looks yeah. quite bright. It looks uh, mm -hmm. fresh. Fresh. Not dusty. It looks fresh. It kind of reminds me of the uh, the SC Air Dry. Should we compare it? Yeah. Give me one second. It's going to... Uh... Let's, let's just wrap up. No, no, no hold on. Let, I'm going to let the other ones dry. Just very quickly. Red bug.
<laughs> is it close or what? It seems to be. Yeah. This is a little bit bluer. Yeah, it's more blue. Yeah. But it's close. This one also is excellent. It is, yeah. And it wore very well with their yep. clear coat mm -hmm. as a top coat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And if you would like to learn uh, a little bit more about the manicuring parts, I made a very good video about the cuticle. I'm going to list the video below because a lot of people are asking about the, the manicure parts, like how to um, do a proper manicure and what's, what's the proper way of doing manicure. Should you cut the skin around the nails, which is not a cuticle by the way, or not, and how to prevent like dry um, skin around the nails. So all of that is in the video, what? Hmm? Below, you don't look impressed. Did I say something wrong? No, oh, no, okay. I'm just sitting here. Minding my own business. Minding my own business, yeah. That truly, I have nothing bad nothing to say. smart to say? Or smart for that instance, yeah. No, no. yeah. So you know what, I managed to do a very good job with this polish. Yep. Very good. So I don't have much to clean. Ooh, actually, I do have something smart to say. Okay. No, never mind. <laughs> what? Please like the video? Yeah. Subscribe? Like, subscribe, hit that bell notification button so you know when we launch videos. Launch. Launch. Okay, we're gonna give it five minutes now because this is kind of like, it's not super, super wet, but it's like kind of a little wet. Five minutes, <laughs> five minutes. It's not wet, but it's wet. Okay, so it's been like how many minutes? 10, almost, no? Nine. Mm -hmm. So it's pretty, looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. So far I'm impressed. So let's see how the top coat works. We're gonna give it, uh, yeah, I think the best thing to do is like really give them 15 minutes and then judge the polish because they can't you know expect the nail polish to be like dazzle dry which is like five minute drawing mm -hmm. oops as you're eating the cookies i'm not eating anything you were but anyway um yeah nice application of the top coat I kind of wish that the Topco had the same um, brush, but it doesn't. Um, where's this made? Again? France. All of them? No, one of them is made in the UK. Okay, the France. Two, I think the polish and the top coat oh, are okay. made in France, and then the other one was made in the UK, I believe. Okay. So I thought maybe uh, uh, yeah, no, the uh, base is in the UK. The no? base is in uh, France. Sorry. Oh, okay. So then this one is in UK. Correct. Okay. Well, so far, mm -hmm. my initial impressions. I'm, I'm impressed actually. Mm -hmm. Your first impressions are impressed. Indeed. Did I do the thumb? No. No, we haven't. Uh... Okay, so this one flat. So I have to say that the uh, color, the look, the formula is more than I expected. Mm -hmm. It's good. Top coat is a little thick, but it's to be expected when they call it like a gel. Mm -hmm. It kind of and with my uh, a little bit. With my but... potato fingers, uh, you know, maybe that might work very well. Since I'm very rigid. 
Yeah. Okay, so we're going to give them 15 minutes. 15 minutes to dry and we'll be back with the results of the dry initial. Okay, so this is a 10 minute test and it's still, mind you, this on the corner, it was uh, obviously applied thicker, so mm, still a little, still a little wet. This is going to be drier because I applied this thinner. Okay, so let's wait another five minutes. Wow. Right on the mark. 15 minutes. So they kind of feel dry. However. However, we'll see. You know, they're still, yeah. It's they're not dentable. bad, dentable. So, you know, but kind of, I don't know if you would want to say dry to the touch, but close. But the shine is really good, I have to say. Sorry, now you can't see it. Um, they, oh, they look really, I love really the good. Smell of that. Yeah, so we use this. The solar speed spray yeah. is beautiful. Very nice. Oh, yes. Okay, so yes, we're gonna. He's gonna wear it, and we'll be back I in am. a few days. I am. Yes. All right. So see you for now. See you for now. Ciao for now. We're gonna. Go and eat pizza. How now, brown cow? <laughs> ciao, ciao. Okay, so we are on the day number seven, mm -hmm. right? Today's Saturday, so um, seven days of this polish, and we are both quite shocked. Yeah. Yeah. So let's just kind of show the viewers. So there was some, you know, free edge wear, a tiny bit, but there was no chipping. The shine is actually quite good still. Mm -hmm. On both hands. Yeah. Can I see this? And that's yeah. through extensive yeah. guitar play, dishes, you know, yeah. chores, life. And the thumbs. Yeah. I did nothing to be nice to these things, and they did great. Yeah, very, very well. These are some of the best, actually. <laughs> I with did. SC. You know what? You have uh, good luck with the grays. SC. Yeah. Um, SC Expressy two coats of polish and one coat of clear as a top coat. That mm -hmm. lasted really well on you as well. But the shine on this yeah. one is unbelievable and it lasted mm -hmm. very, very well. Um, okay, so in the, next, in the next video, we are going to be doing this. Oops. So yes, um, look forward to the next video. So we're going to be, yeah, I bought these. Okay, this is the same gray, but we're Which gonna do we it didn't anyway. buy twice. No. Oh, this one has like, you know what? This is very similar to the, oh my God, we're gonna compare it to that Chanel. The <gasps> channel? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we'll see. It looks very, s yeah, so we also got this one, but you don't wanna do 11, right? No. And we also get this, got this one, <laughs> but you don't wanna do 12. No. I want to do All right, 10. so we're gonna leave these two for ten next. fingers. Ten this is more, yeah. This is more like a fall kind of. This. I like those two colors. That color combination, I think, mm -hmm. would look really nice. Oh, maybe we can do a manicure like that. Maybe I can have a pinky, purple pinky. <laughs> maybe. Okay, maybe. so this is it for this video. Um, let us know what you think. Okay, so pretty much I picked up the whole collection of um, of these polishes available in Canada. I think there was maybe like three more. Uh, but th that's about it. So I'm hearing from the European viewers that this brand is much more um, extensive in Europe. Really? But in Canada, it's very. I limited. mean, they're they're okay colors, but like you're not going to be able to do that much with these colors, no. Well, it depends on how creative you are. Not what creative. Kind of <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the the colors are quite basics. Uh, basics. basics. They're quite basic here. So let us yeah. know if uh, wherever you are, if you're in Europe somewhere. Uh, where and what you think of them mm -hmm. and, and what your experience has been. Uh, and I can tell you ours, they are uh, very budget friendly. Mm -hmm. And so far, based off of what we've uh, learned from this uh, yeah, experiment, that it lasts very well. So I'm looking forward to doing another experiment. Yeah, maybe with the black. With yeah. these two mm -hmm. to see what happens. So, yeah. yeah. 
Alrighty, All right. so, so this is going are. to be in the future videos and... There's our seven day wear test and, and here's our future video for all of you. Okay, we have to wrap this up. All right, let's okay. wrap this up. We'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye. Ciao.